Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to talk about a new skincare range which I received recently. So this one is going to be a sponsored video. Recently, I have received few skincare products from the brand called Finite. So it's a new skincare product available in the market. They have sent the products to test them out and give my review or opinion about those products. This, These are all these skincare products which I have received. I have received a face cleansing gel, uh, serum and then um, moisture. I'm going to talk about all these three products along with a demo or application. So yes, without further ranting, let's quickly jump into the video. So the first thing that I'm going to talk about is this Finite Face Cleansing Gel. So this is how the packaging looks like. It comes in this beautiful black tube packaging. So this face cleansing gel retails for 499 bucks and you get 100ml of product. And this is the consistency of the product. It's in a beautiful gel consistency. Um, so as you can see, this is how the consistency of the face wash is so now i'm quickly going to cleanse my face with this face wash So yes, now cleansing is done and this is how my face looks like. Right, next we are quickly going to jump into the face serum part. So for this I have this Definite Face Brightening Serum. This is how the packaging looks like. It is so so gorgeous. Again this comes in a beautiful black packaging. So now talking about this brightening serum, this has got Alpha Arbutane, Niacinamide and uh, Everlasting Daisy. I'm not sure about Everlasting Daisy but Alpha Arbutane and Niacinamide are really really good for the skin. They give this beautiful flawless finish skin. According to me in the skin care range niacinamide is something you should everyone should definitely vote and the last product that i'm going to talk about is this one this is the finite moisturizing cream and this is how the outer cardboard packaging looks like so this is how the product has been packed i absolutely love their packaging they are very very unique and they comes in a really nice study packaging not only the inner packaging but also the outer packaging looks very luxe and study they have definitely done an amazing job when it comes to packaging and the product presentation so yes now this one is the finite moisturizing cream and it is called uh, murmur butter and evening prime rose oil so now talking about this product so this is how the finite moisturizing cream looks like it comes in this beautiful black glass tub so when i open this product i have this lid on top and this is how the product looks like it's a nice thick luxurious cream it's thick and creamy but still it's lightweight i'll show you the texture of this product so this is how the product looks like and uh, it blends really really well so this product blends in really well and gives this nice hydrated glowy skin this has got some fragrance which i am absolutely not okay with so yeah now i'm going to apply it on my skin and i'm going to show it to you guys yes this is how the moisturizing a cream looks like it gives this nice healthy glow to the skin now we are done with the demo part next i'm quickly going to talk about this product one by one so first i'm going to talk about this face cleansing gel as it is mentioned it is a gel based cleanser and for this summer season if you have a gel based cleanser or if you have a gel based moisturizer whatever that is in gel based it is really really good for your skin because it's not going to strip down the oil on your skin and it is going to be really really mild and you know it's not going to cause any troubles so this face cleansing gel retails for 400 99 bucks and you get 100 ml of product now talking about the ingredients it has got xylitol and betaine betaine 
yeah. betaine. So in the front side of this packaging, it has been mentioned that it has got xylitol and betaine. But when I turn back and check the ingredient list, the first ingredient that comes into picture is aqua. So it has got maximum of aqua content. And then the second ingredient is sorbitol. So when I check it, xylitol is like one, two, Xylitol is the 13th ingredient and betaine is the 14th ingredient which means that the percentage of this ingredient in this product is not higher it's very minimal let's check what xylitol does i googled it xylitol boosts skin hydration level by improving skin barrier function so yeah xylitol is used to boost the hydration level so basically they use xylitol as a humectant in most of the dry skin cream products so now you should know like it's just for enhancing the hydration level so next talking about this betan betan is a beautiful anti-aging product it definitely helps in you know sorting out this wrinkles fine line kind of issues now i don't know why that has been included in face wash face wash targeting wrinkles anti-aging properties i'm not sure but yeah this is the two ingredient which has been added and it's also not the major ingredient as I have mentioned earlier it is the 13th and 14th uh, ingredient in the ingredient list. Now talking about the performance of this cleanser it's really good it cleanses your skin so well it's not stripping off the excess oil but still this one has got a very strong fragrance which I'm not okay with because I'm a person who don't like fragrance in my skincare product but this one has very very strong fragrance to it like very citrusy kind of fragrance so if you're not okay with any fragrance or if you have sensitive nose then and this is not going to be okay for you well, apart from the fragrance part the face cleanser on skin works really well but when you like kind of overwash then this is going to irritate your skin this one cleanses your skin really well but if you are using quite frequently on one single day then this may not work it's not that mild so that's what i'm trying to convey it's not a very very gentle mild kind of face wash next let's talk about this finite um brightening face serum so this serum is really really amazing so yeah now talking about this face serum you get 30 ml of product for 888 bucks it's quite expensive compared to the minimalist uh, serum and all so this face serum has a couple of actives one is alpha arbutin and the next one is niacinamide and the third one is everlasting daisy so I'm not sure about this everlasting daisy, but uh, I know how alpha arbutin and niacinamide works. So if you're into actives, you will definitely know what is niacinamide and what is alpha arbutin. So if you're new to this actives, then I'll tell you niacinamide is basically a very good skincare ingredient. It helps in sorting this acne issues, bumps and you know scars. Um, pigmentation all those skin problems so if you have a very problematic skin the first ingredient like active ingredient that you should definitely try is niacinamide it's going to work like wonder so yeah that is the first ingredient i have tried a lot of niacinamide serums which i'll talk about in a separate video but right now this one has got niacinamide and the next ingredient is alpha arbutin now talking about alpha arbutin it's such an amazing active ingredient for your skin it's definitely going to you know help in sorting out this pigmentation dark spots and darkness issues so if you have a lot of darkness issues going on your skin then you can definitely use serums that have alpha arbutin so yeah now talking about this serum this has got both alpha arbutin and niacinamide which is a big plus and it is very very lightweight to my surprise this serum is like water okay it's in very thin liquid consistency which is something really really amazing when you apply it on your skin your skin is quickly going to observe it you're not going to feel any greasy or oiliness or any stickiness on your skin so yeah especially on the summer season if you have such kind of serum then that is going to be really good okay so yeah i absolutely absolutely love this serum it has got very very mild fragrance which is going to fade away in a minute or two and coming to the performance of the serum it worked really well i tried it for a week and it definitely helped in reducing the hyperpigmentation to a certain extent not like magic i applied it for a week and i was able to see a very little amount of change you know it's very very minute okay so it's not a drastic change it's a very minute change so yeah i think i should try this product for a month or two and then i should come up with a review but as of now it's really good finally we are going to talk about this moisturizing cream this one retails for 610 bucks and you get uh, 50 grams of product now this one i absolutely love the texture of this moisturizing cream but when it comes to fragrance it has got a strong fragrance 
as i have mentioned i love skincare products that do not have fragrance or like very mild fragrance should be okay but it should not be very strong so i like this moisturizing cream but i did not enjoy using this one because it didn't go well on my skin it's a very nice thick luxurious cream but when applied on the skin it blends in and gets absorbed in the skin so well but like after 20 or 30 minutes i felt a little bit of greasiness on my skin i'm not okay in applying this product during summer season i felt that i have applied something on my skin it's a little bit heavy so yeah if you have oily skin i will not recommend this product to you guys and uh, since i have very sensitive nose i am not okay with the fragrance but if you're okay with the strong fragrance and if you have very very dry skin you can definitely give it a try so yes that's it about all these finite skincare products that i have received so hope you like this content if you really find it helpful then please give a big thumbs up and also if you have not subscribed to my channel do subscribe and also don't forget to click on the bell icon to receive all my updates on your notification box so next time with another beautiful content i'll meet you guys and let's bye from priya bye bye